so I'm back in my car on my way to go get my car washed. It's a beautiful day. It says 86 degrees in my car, but I'm sure that's because it's been sitting in the sun. But I'm say I'm thinking it's probably at least 75 degrees right now. Can't go wrong with that, right? Now hold on, let me make sure I have everything. Okay, I got that, I got that, I got my bag, got my phones, my tablet. Oh, there's my glass case. I was looking for that. Okay, cool, right? Look, they're sunglasses now. They just turn to sunglasses when you come out into the sun. Very cool, right? Hey, if you gotta have glasses, you gotta have cool glasses, right? I don't know, they're kind of big, but I needed to have them big for the progressive lenses, so. Hi. Let me make sure I have towels to clean the car with. I don't want to have to buy new ones. Oh yeah, I got towels. I never remember if I washed them and put them back in the car or not. Most of the time I forget to put them back in the car, just like I forget to put my Albertsons bags back in the car when we go shopping. Okay, so it's already 11.30 give me a, not, a lot of time to do too much so I guess I'll go get the car clean and get it ready for work and then go back home and relax until I gotta get Caitlin. She has an early day today so I'm gonna pick her up, take her to daycare or actually take her to the school that I'm trying to transfer her to first and then take her to daycare so I can go to work I think I'm gonna bring the camera to work with me today and ask my clients if they want to be on camera or if they mind being on camera. And I'm gonna open it up as mental awareness, mental health awareness or mental illness awareness. And I'm gonna tell them that's why I'm making the videos and I'm gonna ask them questions and whatnot. Ask them if they know anyone that's mentally ill. Kind of get their opinion and see if they know anyone. See how many people know somebody. And I'm, I got my new ring recently. It's a um, semicolon, like the one on my face and the one on my wrist, which you can't see because the cast is there. Um, shit. I forgot to call them to see if I was supposed to go get my casting off today. Or soon. I know I gotta get it off soon. I feel like I've had it forever. I know my wrist is gonna be really limp when I get it off because when they took the first one off, my wrist was like super sore. It's been straight for six weeks. So... I was thinking, since I have all this free time, that I would get back to my story. I believe it was episode 10E, where I ended off at where I was first um, institutionalized. So I'm going to end here so I can start back up with that a brand new video. <clears throat> Try to keep those separate from just the daily routine stuff. I have a tendency to say a little bit too much in front of my daughter sometimes and although she's very smart, there's probably something she doesn't really need to know about her mom right now that she doesn't wouldn't quite understand. So I'm going to end off here and start back up with Hampstead Hospital 10E continued. So, um, yeah, keep listening, keep watching. Um, our lives do uh, have some fun times in it and some uh, wacky times, so it won't all be all this boring stuff, but, you know, it is kind of my intent 
to get all this stuff out. So um, that's what I'm going to do. So peace out for now. Tune in for episode 10E continued Hampstead Hospital.